there is a lot of Monday morning quarterbacking that goes on in the law. Right? And oddly enough, it's the people who are always contradicting their lawyer or hiring one lawyer, firing another and going on like this. These people tend to get the worst results. Right? It takes them a very long time to resolve um, their legal matters. It's more costly for them and it's a lot more stressful. On the other hand, it seems to be the people who are selective in choosing their lawyer. And then once they have their lawyer, they just sit back and let the lawyer do his job. Things tend to go more smoothly for these people and they tend to get better results uh, and pay less money for, for the legal services. Now, I would say this regarding outside legal advice. First, if it's coming from a lay person, it's, it's almost always uh, bad advice. Uh, in, in the vast majority of the time, it's far worse advice than even the most average mediocre lawyer could give to you. Now, I don't care if this, this lay person is um, an accountant, a police officer, a clerk at the court, whatever it may be. Um, usually they really don't understand uh, the job of the attorney and what the lawyer is doing. And so, so you, you shouldn't um, take their advice uh, and, and throw it in the face of your lawyer. Second, if you're taking advice from another lawyer, you should consider, first of all, the lawyer's experience. So he should have as much if not more experience in the field that your current lawyer is, is working in. And you should consider his, his motivation because often he's just trying to get a new client. And a lot of times he'll tell you, well, this, the simple solution is X, Y, and Z here. And it seems clear cut and easy uh, to the prospective client. But if you already have a lawyer, um, you can guarantee your lawyer has already um, recognized this this simple solution and it doesn't work in your situation for whatever reason okay so so you should like I said at the beginning be very selective when choosing a lawyer when you when you found the right lawyer you should uh, just let the lawyer do his job um, and if you're going to take advice from outside it should be from a lawyer who's uh, not motivated by trying to pull you away from your current lawyer and should have more experience and knowledge in the field than your present lawyer. I've written a blog post on this and I'll put it in the description below.